What is up, boys and girls? We are back again. Uh, we got ourselves this awesome little, uh, this awesome mobile game uh, game here. It's called uh, Last Days on Earth Survival. It's actually still in beta right now. Uh, but if you uh, if you enjoy survival games, if you're a mobile user, uh, this is definitely an awesome game for you. As you see, I've kind of messed around with it a little bit. Uh, you kind of start in this little area over here, uh, your own little house. And you have this truck here uh, that kind of can hold some stuff. And you can kind of go around this uh, this little map, this little map that you have that you can start on, get some rocks, some wood, uh, some fruits and stuff like that. And you can eventually build something up. It's really neat. Um, I'll show you this in a second. This is actually some stuff right here uh, that I got going. Uh, these right here, uh, these are carrot seeds. So you can grow, uh, you can grow carrots in this little... Uh, in this little guy right here, this little farm. Um, you can build yourself some boxes to hold stuff. Um, all kinds of different stuff that you can use um, to run around and you know farm stuff up and uh, just become better. Uh, and you can kind of come here uh, into this little thing. And as you see, uh, as you get up in level, you can make better and cooler items. And it seems that it goes all the way up uh, to level 88, uh, to where you can make all kinds of crazy, uh, crazy guns and stuff like that. Um, there are, there is multiplayer. Uh, it will take you a little bit of time uh, until you can pick up the radio tower here. Uh, until you hit level 28, uh, you can make that. Join a clan, uh, get workers uh, in order to make your, in order to make your stuff like your CB radio, like that's right here, um, or your you know, smithing station uh, work a little bit faster there. They'll kind of speed up your process and uh, the resources you get out of it. Uh, but you can see it's definitely uh, it's definitely a lot of fun. Uh, you can just come in here and just kind of drop all your stuff off. Um, like I said, I've been playing this a little bit, so I'm a little bit I'm a little bit ahead of ahead of the start. Um, let's see what else can we drop off here. We can drop off these guys. We can drop off this, kind of empty our inventory out a little bit, because uh, it is a little bit harder to uh, to get stuff. Ooh, we actually can go put that back in our other box, which I think is this one. Nope, it must be this one. It's this one. Okay, so we have three engine parts. That's good. Um, so I'll show you this in a second here. You basically get energy. Uh, you basically get this energy bar every day um, that you can kind of... Uh, that you know over time will go back uh, will refill itself um, before we do that this guy right here is important he's a rain catcher uh, so that'll give you your uh, your bottles uh, if you have empty bottles of water um, you can put this little guy here this rain catcher um, which you can just you know kind of make out of some stuff you'll be able to find fairly easily uh, make one of those and it'll really help you with that as well as like we said the um, uh, the campfire up there and stuff like that that'll help you really make your food um, now here's the global map right here um, and I'll show you this it, it takes only a second or two to uh, to load in it's really not that bad as you see um, so here's my uh, here's my place um, up here that is uh, that's another player's space right there uh, and you can run over there and uh, take stuff out of there so it's kind of uh, it's kind of interesting, and it only gets better. Um, so we're gonna come right here. This gives you two options uh, to either use energy, uh, 15 energy, to run there, which will take eight seconds, or you could walk there uh, for no energy, but that'll also take you 12 minutes, almost 13 minutes. Uh, so you can kind of uh, you can kind of do this really quick, and just kind of uh, kind of run up there, and see what uh, see what resources this place might have and uh you know take a walk back or something kind of let the phone alone for a minute uh this is a game where you can kind of you know come in do a few things and, you know go back out and be about your day um, which is really good um as you see up here uh well it kind of went away a little bit quicker uh than we had hoped but you can come into your backpack right here uh and this will be your hunger right there and that'll be your thirst right there. So then that way you can keep track of that fairly easily. Uh, as well as your different stats uh, right down here with your uh, your weapon damage, 
your defense, your speed, um, and your attack speed, uh, respectively. Uh, so you can come in here, and uh, let's see what this guy's got. So we have a hatchet. We made a we made a hatchet already, which you will have to keep up with. Uh, as you see, we have that guy right there. Uh, so you have to keep up with the hatchet. Actually, I want to put this uh, I want to put this machete in here. Uh, just because our gun is running low and I don't want to use it too, too much. Because um, those are kind of rare to find at the current moment. Uh, oh, there we go. So you can kind of just come in here and you can see it's not too bad trying to kill those guys out. So you want to kind of be careful at certain points. Uh, just to not get, you know, overrun by a whole bunch. Like as you see, uh, there are some stronger ones here. So you just kind of got to be careful going out at certain points. Um, you can also go and you can explore bunkers, uh, military bases, and stuff like that. And uh, it can get a little bit uh, it can get a little bit str uh, strange trying to go in there, um, and you fill up your pack pretty fast. So you got to kind of uh, you got to kind of do some back and forth. So it's good to you know kind of you know come in here, uh, run through, use some of your energy. Uh, fill up your inventory, uh, go back, and then you kind of come back, uh, back and forth from your phone. So, you know, like I said, it's a it's a touch and go game, but uh, it is still in beta, so there are changes that will eventually be made. Um, but it's definitely a fun game if you enjoy survival games. Um, if you're if you're really into mobile uh, mobile games, this is an awesome game to stop by and try out. Um, I've played it for a couple of days, and I've had an absolute blast doing it. Um, and it's actually not too hard to level. Uh, you get you get uh, EXP from just about everything that you do. As you see, you know I'm. As you see, you know I'm getting you know 50 EXP from killing zombies. Um, I'm getting EXP from picking up rocks. Uh, so you can get EXP fairly fairly easily. It's just you got to kind of uh, run around and do stuff, and that's about it. Um, so we're gonna do that. And all you got to do to leave an area is run over to this little green area run far into it and it'll take you right back to the world map uh, but we're actually going to go back because we are thirsty and pretty hungry so we got a few resources probably could have stayed longer but unfortunately i forgot to eat and drink before we left uh, so we can just make it back and this is basically all that you do by the way this this guy over here that's a military base uh that one right there is a military base um, and if you look, you can actually see uh, there's green, there's orange, and there's red arrows above the uh, the different places here to let you kind of know uh, the danger the danger level of how it might uh, how it might be. So definitely give this game a try. Uh, it's a lot of fun, um, and uh, let me know what you guys think because I'm having a blast with it, and. Uh, it it is still in beta, like we said, so it can only get it it can only get better from here. So uh, let me know what you guys think, but uh, I'm gonna get out of here and uh, kind of mess around and see what else I can, what other stuff I can get into for the moment. Uh, so thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed, uh, and let me know if you guys tried this game out and what you think. Uh, but we're gonna leave it here, and I'm gonna see you next time.